Hey guys, welcome to Small Land, Survive the Wilds. Descend through the darkness of Giant's Fall, Chapel and Crypt. Now, this is a new update that unleashes new locations, armor, enemies and more in its first content update. Journey deep into the ruins of Giant's Fall Chapel and brave the creeping, crawling dark of the crypt in pursuit of ancient relics which will reveal the next chapter of the Small Land Saga. So, for those of you who are new, in this game you explore a rich and immersive landscape as the small folk, a tiny race of people battling lake-sized puddles, mountainous trees and monstrous creatures. You scavenge through materials to build encampments, craft powerful armor sets and delicious heartwarming food as you carve out your legacy in the wilds. As you gain a foothold in this dangerous environment, find and tame creatures to ride into battle and explore the world from a new perspective. Now, these are some of the key features for those of you who are unfamiliar with the game that have just been released. You can now scale skyscraper sized trees. Yeah, that's a mouthful. Scramble through caravaners, cracks in the roads, and more as you experience the unique biomes of Small Land's huge open world. You can craft powerful armor sets, new ones have been released to personalize your appearance, grant you resistance from the elements, abilities and more. You can now tame and ride wild creatures from geckos to even spiders. The world and its inhabitants are yours to conquer. You can scavenge, refine and craft resources to build your encampment on the ground or even in the canopy. You can claim a great tree to design and build a base that will follow you anywhere in the world. That's right, anywhere. Uncover ancient lore from hidden NPCs scattered throughout the world as you learn to survive in the hostile wilderness. New NPCs have been released in this latest update. And now for the best part, you can play solo or with up to 9 additional friends in multiplayer with crossplay between Steam and even the Epic Game Store. So without further ado, let's just jump right in, shall we? Vanguard, your queen is ill, gravely ill. This is why, as your king, I am asking for your help. Venture into the overland and seek out a cure. Whatever the cost, be bold, be brave, remain vigilant. From King Valdemar's speech to the Vanguard Corps. Can I see how my character looks? Hey, not too shabby. Hello, handsome. Oh my god, purple eyes was not a good choice. <laughs> Alright. Um, F to interact, F to auto hold, left shift to sprint, space to jump, C to crouch. Why am I not crouching? Oh, okay. Control to dodge and space bar to jump. Okay, so I can't jump while I crouched. I gotta come up. Alright. Sentinel Virgil, I have to talk. Greetings, I've been tasked with meeting all vanguards before they leave the burrows as I have crucial information to impart. Keep an eye trained for the owl effigies. They are scattered throughout the area and provide useful hints and tips to help you survive. Outside you'll find Captain Herney. He will help you in the first days outside the burrows. Thank you. Owl Effigy Harvesting The owl overland is rich with natural resources and food and some can only be harvested with the correct tool. You can craft different tools to harvest natural resources. Some resources can only be harvested with the specific types of tools. So be sure to learn the best tool for the job. Press V to engage Athena mode in order to help you spot harvest resources much easier. Let's see. Ooh. How do I get out of this? Do I click it again? Yeah, I do. Okay. What is this? Resin. Oh, okay. Craft at workbench. Tab to open inventory. Where are you? Am I wearing you? Yes, I am. Alright. Mushroom steak. Bandage. Wooden club. Can I equip you? resin okay I 
mouse sensitivity is super high. I'm going to need to adjust this just for a moment. Um, where am I under? Hold to sprint, SVs. Input. Uh, let's bring you down. 0 0.6 perhaps. I am using a mouse and keyboard. A little better. Oh, owl. When you examine an owl FAG, it reveals useful pieces of advice. This info is automatically logged in your compendium, which you can access at any time from the inventory menu. Press tab to open the inventory and select. Okay, so basically you can check out tips. In case you're like me and sometimes tend to skip tutorials. Yep, tap for inventory. Yeah, you can do that. You can also check on which armor sets can be crafted by which small folk once you seek them out what does that mean oh crafting okay wood hatchet can i craft you now i can okay let's put that in the inventory i have a wooden club what is the hammer for build a tool can i craft this insufficient material okay so i need fiber and wood torch firefly torch okay we'll go through as we progress I guess don't want to spend my time though reading what's this oh, okay gotcha another owl but Boros is an extensive network underground tunnels and caverns is home to the small folk intricate with multiple levels and branching paths do, 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 do. there is there are lit by glowing crystal lamps and makeshift torches creating a warm inviting atmosphere well, it is inviting for a tunnel. Is that mushroom? No, it's not. Is that safe? What are you? Insect egg? Am I stealing? My wife can make a mean pixie omelette. Food at the root barracks can become pretty stale lately. Luckily, my sister brought me some fresh insect eggs this morning. Gee, I hope no one takes them. Yep, I'm just gonna walk out of here. All you need for speedy repairs is a good builder's hammer. Ha hammer. Oh my god, I can't speak. Mold, mold everywhere. Can I take the tools? No? Make sure to search out these owl effigies for useful information. Yes, thank you. I already know that. Ooh, are these eggs? May the sacred owl be with you, Vanguard. That must be someone important. The saluting to me. Good luck in the overland, Vanguard. Keep your wits about you and stay frosty. Can I take this? Yes, I can. Nasty creatures out there. Have you heard about the queen? I pray to the sacred owl she makes a full recovery. What happened to the queen? I mean, maybe that's why the king asked for help? I'm not sure. Oh yeah, the cure. Okay, yeah. I'm obviously not paying attention. Ooh. The game was rendering in. I wish I was on a night du night watch duty, but it's in the morning. The overland is a dangerous enough place during the day. Captain Hurney is stationed downhill from here. You should go and introduce yourself to him. Yes, I will. This is looking good. Damn. Is that a map? There is. Ah, I am Groot. You can see my name. All right. It is a relatively big map. Like this is me, right here. So small. Okay. More owls. You can lose health due to a variety of factors. Being attacked by hostile creatures. Temperature? 
falling from a great height or being malnourished. Huh. So there's hunger in the game. Okay, I see it now on the bottom left. So there's health, hunger, comfortable, I guess that's the weather, and then 15 over 100, I guess that's EXP. Now experience points. Sprinting, sliding, dodging, jumping, attacking, and blocking all consume stamina. Pay attention when it comes low. Okay. Oh, okay, I see it. It's the green bar in the center. Press M to open the map. Yeah, I done that. Your spawn location, your grave and any custom markers you add. Ah, okay, so I can mark my own map. That's useful. Doo -doo -doo. It's a lot of stuff I can take here. Armor provides protection, keeps you warm in the cold. Some shelters in the overland have the expertise to make new sets of armor for you. Okay. Useful information, thank you. Greetings Vanguard, welcome to the Overland, I'm Captain Hernus, many cubby, but most small folks simply call me Herny. What can I do for you? Could you craft armor for me? I was told to report for you for my assignment. Okay, craft me armor first. Sure Vanguard, but you will have to bring me all the necessary materials. Uh, sure, craft me something. Fiber, I need so many. Ooh. Padded armor, this is what? Cold protection 9, protection 1. What is this? Movement speed 2%. Okay, so they have different perks. Uh, uh, so the padded one keeps me warm, whereas this one gives me movement. It's a lot of fiber. Uh, what questions can I ask? How do I build myself a shot? First you need to craft a builder's hammer. Equipped it to start building. Beware. Weather in the overland can damage your constructions unless they're covered by a roof. Okay. Good to know. And now report for the assignment. Ah yes, I've been expecting you. The elder Ludwig has requested for your presence. Go see him at once. He's staying in the cave just down the hill. Alright. Thank you. Now let's see, can I craft that hammer right now? Crafting Builder's hammer, hammer, yes I can. I guess I'm just too excited. Maybe. <laughs> make sure to eat and drink regularly. Being well nourished will make you more resilient and energetic as well as strong in combat. Okay, so food affects your power, I guess. Uh -huh, uh -huh. You can eat food raw or prepare it in other consumables using different types of cooking stations for a wide range of benefits. Can I have you? Yes, I can. What else can I pick up? I'm going to take those. Thank you. Fiber. Anything else? Nope. Okay, I'm out of here. It's probably a good choice to add that skill. I can see what's like interactable. Ooh. I wonder if those are hostile. Okay, wait, can I cut this down? Nope. Wait, can I? I think I can. Or maybe I can't. Oh well. Can I swim in this game? Uh, it doesn't look like I was swimming very well. <laughs> I was more like gracefully drowning. Stay away from deep water. <laughs> Small folk can't swim. Upon death, you will respawn at your activated bed or spawn location. Gee, maybe I should have checked that out before I actually tried that. I guess this game will get a bit grindy until you get what you need. I'm gonna be collecting a bit more fiber and then maybe I'll just head back over. Temperature will generally drop at night. 
race in the afternoon. Also, some creatures of the overland are nocturnal. Build a bed to sleep. You can only sleep at night, and for you to fall asleep, you must be sheltered. Okay. So maybe it'll be a good idea to get the padded armor and then perhaps I have to take it off in the afternoon because it'll probably be too hot. I'm not sure how this works just yet. Kinda excited with this system. Alright, I think I probably have enough. I'm gonna head back up just for a moment to get the armor and then I'm gonna head down to the guy I'm supposed to make Ludwig, I think his name was. Hopefully, I got enough. Okay, let's go for the padded. Yeah. Do, 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 do. Okay. Now, equipped it, or am I already wearing it? Oh, there we go. Okay, pet it. Okay, there we go. I could probably change my outfit once. Um, how do I eat? Do I right click? I do. 48, and now it's 56. Oh, it goes down really fast. 55 now. Found few insects. I can eat nourishment six. Can heal. Maybe I'll save it a little bit. Okay. Wait, how about the mushrooms? Sorry, wrong button. 30 nourishments? Alright, I'll take it. 84. Okay, good. Oh, wait. What's this? Resource to people, tools and weapons, food can be crafted out of materials, yeah, 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 you need a crafting station to craft new weapons, but every vanguard knows how to craft some basic tools, okay. I probably won't be building a base just yet, until maybe I pass some of the story progression. Like, because I don't even know where I want to build the place yet. It kind of... Still figuring this out. Okay, is it this way? Can I find out? The elder. Okay, yeah, should be going the right way. Anything I can take? Doesn't sound safe. Hello! Vanguard, finally you're here. Yeah, it took me a while. The jeweled clover key that unlocks the apothecary chest has gone missing. I fear it may have been stolen. We're here trying to find some other means of opening the chest. What's in the chest? Malka, apothecary's greatest achievement. The elixir of life. He claimed he could heal any ailment known to small folk. Is that for the queen then? Mm. Have you tried forcing the chest? We did not. We dare not. The chest is heavily reinforced and we would risk destroying the elixir within. Seek out the settlers and investigate their claims. Does this have to do with the clover key? But we have no evidence to suggest that there is no connection. Okay. Uh, you'll find the settlers scattered throughout the forest. I have marked their locations on your map. Be careful, Vanguard. The wilderness is filled with danger. Hernie and Caliph can help you survive here in the overland. Okay. Anything I can take from you? No? Alright, let's check the map real quick. Wait, who am I? What? Where are the people I'm supposed to meet? The settlers. Uh, is that that? Uh, do I go all the way there? Excuse me. Wait, what? That's so far away. Khalif is the person who's gonna help me survive. So, am I going to choose Tana? I don't know. Let's just uh, find out the hard way. Okay, so I marked it on the map. If you look at the top, it should indicate where he is. Okay, so this direction, it's northeast. Hopefully, I don't run into anything that kills me right away. 
Okay, let's see. Structures. Uh, campfire, workbench, simple bed, simple chest, and a sign. I can make foundations. Can I make it right here? Okay, so I'm not allowed to build in the starting. Alright, cool. Walnut chest. Hinges on the front. Strange cavity in the shape for you to try to open the chest. Wait, I thought you're not allowed to open the chest. What happens if I click yes, and then I destroy the elixir? I mean, if it if it isn't if it is the same chest. Hmm. Push the bottom cavity. Nothing happens, man. Okay, fine. Um. So there's nowhere I can go from here then. I'm guessing this is the chest that I need to open. Now we just need to find the people this elder was talking about. Can I block? Okay, so left click light attack and then right click heavy attack. Alright. Off we go then. Am I even going the right way? Doesn't <laughs> doesn't look like it. Um Okay. Let's just see where the road takes us. Needs a wood hatchet. So I can harvest this? Edible mushroom. Wait, where's the mushroom? Can I not pick it up? Or is it in my inventory already? It's not. Huh. Oh, there we go. It didn't show up in the scan. Uh. Okay, so he's in this direction. How do I cross this area? Do I need to go there around this way? Or do I go this way? It's already night. Ah. Mm. Let's try and go up that area where the owl is and then let's see if I can build something. Are you hostile? Level 3 butterfly? Doesn't seem like it. Oh my god, that's... That my first enemy encounter. Okay, make a quick run for it. What are you? Alright, maybe let's not stay to find out. It's probably a spider. Let's see if I can build my base up here. I do have quite a lot of resources, so hopefully I can build my base up here. Not sure if it's a good idea. Let's just see what happens. Small folk believe owls possess magical powers and worship them as some kind of divinity. Idols, statues and decorations are crafted in their honor. Bugs, lymph, food. Oh my god, was that an offering? No one saw that, right? I think I stole the owl's offering. Okay, now, time to find out if I can build here. Foundations. <gasps> I can. Okay, so I can rotate. Can I lift? I can lift. Ooh. Can I build at the edge? No. What's advanced rotate? What is this? Track to rotate? Okay. Okay, so I can't flip it. 
I'm just going to leave it as it is and I'm gonna put it right there. Yeah, how do I cancel? Right click? No, okay. So I can repair, I can dismantle. Um, let's see, how much? It takes two wood and one fiber, that's pretty cheap. Can I click on it? Yes, it goes, good. Let's make a four. Oops, sorry, I keep pressing escape to go out of build mode. Okay, now that I have this. Ooh. Okay, the decoration, some. Um, let's get a door frame down. Which way? From here? Yeah, maybe I can expand out here. I'm not too sure whether the game will allow me. Like it's a floor, maybe pillars. Uh, let's see which way. I could probably jump up, but to be safe, I'll probably put the door. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! <gasps> I'm at one HP. Okay, stay calm. Everything's okay. No enemies around. That was silly. Let's heal, shall we? Wait, I thought he heals. It does not. Let's use the bandage. Oh, it's just, just to stop bleeding. Heal small wounds. Okay, there we go. I'm slowly healing. Oh my god. Death almost reached me on the first night. <laughs> ah. Alright, all is good. Okay, so one bandage healed me about what twenty-five health. Mm, not too bad. Probably gotta find out how to build not build but make bandages. Okay, back to building safely, please. No more falling down. Okay, let's go. Door frame down. Oh um, Let's put a window. Let's rotate. Oh, is this the inside? Yeah. Okay, fine. Let's put another one here so I get a nice view. And maybe another one here. Let's build is this a door. Okay, let's build a wall. Good. And then here. Be nice if this clicks in place so I don't have to manually rotate. But it's cool. Okay, door. Uh, uh, the handles are usually on the left for me. Does it matter if it's here? Let's just try it. I mean, it opens the right way. But the handle's not in here. Oh well. Okay, so I need a roof. Uh, I only have two fiber left. How does this work? So if I just... Can I put it on each corner? I can. Okay, so I probably just need... A bit more fiber. And then I should be able to complete. I need a bit more for a bed. How much is a bed? Uh huh, and I also need a workbench, so I need just wood and fiber as well. It looks like a moth, not a butterfly anymore. And I gotta be careful when I go down. Just take some of you as well, since I'm already here. Can I see what I can pick up from here? I. Kinda can't, okay. Mushroom and an as. What is that? Asasia? Akakia? Oh boy. Okay, not friendly. Clearly not friendly. It's morning already. Oh my god! Oh my god, jump scare. Since when will Grasshopper's aggressive? I can still hear him. 
come on. Be nice. No, you can come all the way up. Oh my god! Wait, what? Was it not aggressive? You better not be in my house. Friendly? Are you friendly? You don't seem f No! Okay, I'm at 1 HP. Uh, 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 uh. Not friendly. No, it's destroying my house. My first house. Mercy. What do I do? Duke. Okay, I gotta heal. What's the probability of it gone? Nope. 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 Ha! Ha! Okay. Now, what is the price for repair? Is it free? Uh, doesn't seem to cost anything. I I hope that was one hit. Why am I making a house out of twigs? It didn't cost anything, right? Yeah, I still have my wood. Uh, okay. Still looking good on food. I probably did not pick a good place to build. Hmm. Alright, hopefully Mr. Grasshopper is not there anymore. He still is. That's not an insect, is it? No, come on. You don't see me, right? Okay, quickly get the plant. And then we're out of here. Okay, it does not work. Hmm. Where can I get... What's this? I need fiber. Needs a Mandy Bullar pickaxe. Bottle cap. Can I just take the stone as it is? Hmm, I know I can't swim, but can I cross? There's plenty of resources on that side. Oh, let's see if I can make this jump. I cannot, oh no. Okay, so lesson learned. Don't swim. Okay, so I did lose everything except for what I crafted. So what I'm wearing does not disappear. What I was holding did not disappear. But everything else did. Good to know. Thankfully, my house is just right there. I see it. And good news is, I can now collect plant fiber safely. It was intentional death, guys. Clearly, I planned it because I knew exactly where I was going to respawn. Safe and away from the grasshopper. Huh, it seems like every resource I picked up just now has respawned. So I guess they grow back? I could be wrong.
I'm nowhere near to completing the task I was asked to do. Too busy trying to build a home. Somewhere to respawn. It was this way. Do 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 do. This should be enough for a workbench and the roofs. Uh, yeah, definitely plenty. Leveled up, you earned new attribute points to spend. Okay, how does one spend attribute points? Haha, <laughs> gravestone. I guess I can get my stuff back. Okay, so this is the compendium. So everything you've discussed is here. Codex, I guess that's stuff I can craft. Or stuff I've crafted before. So maybe there's like four slots of stuff you can craft some more, I'm not sure. Okay, so these are all the people or the stuff that I can craft. There's a lot of stuff. So how do I spend my points? J? No? K? L? P? No? U? No? Alright, maybe I'll find out later on. Ooh, level 3 butterfly. Health, stamina, damage, speed. I see, so I can use the scan on... Animal Sue. Can I ride you? I guess I gotta tame you first, somehow. Okay, back home. Let's go. Oops, wrong button. So not used to using F. I'm usually using E. There are five distinct weapon types for Vanguard. You can wield, blunt, edge, piercing, poison, and fire. The creatures you encounter in the Overland have different strength and weakness when it comes to each. Pay attention to the icon next to their health bar, which determines which weapon type will be more effective. And I really like this owl effigies. Refugees. Mercy. Okay, you know what? I'm near home. Let's fight. Never mind, there's more than one. Okay, I'm out. No, no, jump. Uh, right side. Let's go. Carpenter end. They're quite balanced. Use bows and arrows to hit creatures from afar. There are bows and arrows? Okay, so I need the workbench, I assume. Let's go make that first. With a bow and arrow, I could probably be the apex predator here, rather than being hunted all the time. Like, it's quite a chore to climb up here every time, but I kind of feel like this is probably the safest place I'm going to be able to build. Oh man, I got to build another hammer. I hope I have enough. Uh, let's see, build this hammer. Oh, it automatically put it in the slot for me. Okay, good. Uh, workbench, where are you? Wait, what? Ah, I forgot, I didn't take any resin. Like after collecting so many just now, it kinda just felt like I had plenty. That's four, and that's five. I'm so glad I didn't collect it all just now. I'll go to my grave soon, but it's unlikely I'm gonna be able to get it because it's in the water. I need to find a way to cross. Wait, oh, well, well, yeah, there's a bridge. I could probably cross it in. Jump into the water to get my stuff, but I don't know if it's worth it. I'll probably try after I make a bit. Chest, sign, bed, and workbench. There we go. Why are you so big? Wait, can I build you outside? No, I cannot. You are huge. Man, I probably gotta expend to six squares. 
Just put you down for now. Uh, let's make a bit right away. Wait, what? Wood. Okay, wood. Fine. Fair enough. Um, can I make my roof? I can. Um, okay, it's not clicking so well. Let's try this side. There we go. Huh. <laughs> this is not how I intended it to be. I thought it would click or uh, link together straight away, but it's not doing that. This is going to be a disaster. Okay. Come on. He doesn't want to go. How about from the outside? Come on. No? Hmm. Let's see if I have a different option. Oh wait, was this the one I wanted? Yeah, it was probably this one. Oh man, okay. So, how do I destroy you? Dismantle, do I get it back? I got one back. There we go, it's clicking a bit better. Let's hope this one connects nicely. Come on. How are we looking? Hey, looking not bad. Looks good. Yeah. I'm pretty happy with how it looks. My first hut. I could probably dismantle these. Okay, let's try and expand right now. Do I have enough wood? Uh, no, I do not. Should I go for my mission first? Okay, wait, let's make the bit before we get distracted. Um, what do I need? Four more wood. Okay. Wait. Workbench. Can I make a better axe? Tools, let's see. I only have wood hatchet for the moment. A bandage. Let's make a few of you. Five, yeah, that's good. Let's put you at zero. Wood sword. Ooh, pierce damage. I also need wood and resin. And how about the arrows? not that much of a difference. Why do I need stone for fire arrow and huh like can't I just burn the wood? Oh well insect fur. It's only extra two damage. Like is it really worth all that material? I can make some armor myself and what's this? Ladybug travel kit. Tame a ladybug as well as backpacks designed to attach to their forewings, providing additional storage space for ladybugs to carry edible mushroom nectar. I'm assuming it's from a flower. I could probably do that soon. Um, okay, let's get some wood to make a bow and a bed. Let's repair. Oh, okay. Okay, wood, wood. Let's go. Let's hope the ladybug is not going to disrupt us. Will I take fall damage? Let's find out. Nope. Okay, good. There we go. Some wood. It's a ladybug. Damage is so high. Oh my god. 
When you dismantle a structure, all the materials used when it was originally built will be dropped and appear as collectible loot. Wait, what? But I only got one back just now. Unless it dropped somewhere else and I missed it. I'm not sure. No. Please, just let me farm in peace. Okay, I got 50 health. Let's do this. Okay, never mind. Why? Why do you gang up on me? Yeah, that's right, you better run. Come on. I could probably win in a one-on-one -on -one fight, right? Yeah, I could do this. One-on-one, -on -one. come on. One-on-one, -on -one. you and me. No, come back. Are you full health? You are. I missed! No! Uh, okay, dealt 8. Are you here to fight? Peace? Peace. What could I get out of you? I don't seem to be able to block. I wanna fight the guys that I've already done damage to. But they don't seem to come alone. I'm just gonna try and kill one. Uh mainly I wanna see what they drop. Game's on pause when I open tab. Good to know. Ooh, sneaky. Sneaky, come back. No, your last hit, come back. How about you? How much health do you have? No, come back. Are you the one who I hit just now? Okay, what does this do? Clear thick fluid extract from insects. It helps with cooling in hot weather and provides rapid hydration. Okay, so it's something to drink. Nourishment 6. Oh my god, I'm at 0. My health is going down. <gasps> Wait, why is my health going down? Oh my god. <laughs> okay, so apparently you don't really hear sounds. <laughs> Okay, so, I thought my health was going down because of my nourishment. Apparently I was being attacked and I did not make a bed. Okay. It's okay, it's okay. I'm gonna go and collect from my body. I'm assuming the end hit is gonna be crafted into something else. I mean, death is not too bad because the respawn is not too far because I just started. I'm trying to get my space and everything down as nearby. So that was a good choice. Probably need a bit more wood. I'm gonna put down my bed and then we'll proceed. So the, I think the theory of not losing what you hold is true. I still have my armor and the hatchet that I was fighting with. Let's hope the end is still there, so I can behead him and take his head. Still wood. Nourishment is at fifty. Not bad. 
It's a lot of ladybugs. If you die, you drop everything in inventory except for what you're holding. Yeah, that's right. Okay, so all is not lost, though you can retrieve all your belongings if you make it back to your tombstone. If you drown in deep water, your tombstone will spawn on the last bit of solid ground you walked on. Oh. Ooh. That's useful information. I thought I lost it in the water. Uh, where is my... Okay, there we go. See, it's so useful to have that as a landmark. Yeah, it seems to be friendly. Where did I die? That's right. Why oh, the music sound epic? Okay, anyways. Wait, where's my body? Uh, I seem to be. Oh, there we go. There's candles and everything. Store all, take all. Okay, so. Where was my other body? Uh, was it this direction? Yeah, it is okay. Let's go and see if I can find my body. It's almost night time. Did I pass? I did. Okay, it's so on the other side. Huh, I'm terrible at reading maps. I can see its... I can see its mouth. Oh no, I'm stuck. Huh, this seems like a bad idea. Where am I? Gravestone? Oh, it's on the lower portion here. That's probably the stone. Yeah, there we go. Right there. I have a feeling I'm gonna fall in. <laughs> uh, okay, there we go. Made it. Take all. I'm rich. Uh, where's the owl? Oh my god! No mercy! It's the same one that tried to hit my house before. Is the owl above? I'm sorry if it's a bit too dark for you guys. I'm at 6 health. Oh my god. I'm out of stamina. Please. Why so many ants? Oh my god. Man. Night time is brutal. Okay, the owl is right there. Where did I die? What was I doing all the way here? How's it going? So far I'm definitely enjoying the game. I'm gonna quickly run over to my body, finish up my bed as I intended to long time ago, and then I'm gonna try and progress the mission, which I assume will be right here where Justana is. Yeah, okay, so it's almost morning based on the clock. I'll probably reach my body in the morning where I can actually see, and it's a bit safer. I know I can make a torch, but uh, I'm kind of stubborn. 
Plus, it probably attract more attention to myself, right? I mean, logically, I would assume so. Okay. Where is my body? Is that it? I would probably assume that light is coming from my body, maybe? Okay, so I gotta go the long way around. Through the bridge. Uh, what are you? A moth. Your damage is really low. Like, this place is so huge and I'm only at a small portion of the map that I've actually ventured. Oh, I didn't see this. There's another person here. I could probably straight away go to Skadi, I guess. Oh yeah, I forgot I can put a mark. Can I put a mark? Can I track this? I can. There we go. Oh, I can even type what I want to type. Um, item. Can I see it? No? Oh, there we go. It's on my map now. Do I wait a bit more? So I can actually see? Um, it's straight ahead. I don't see it just yet. Hmm. Do I have materials on me? Only tree wood. Look at him. I could have died if I went down there. Give me your name. Oh, we can zoom in. It is a nocturnal grasshopper. Wait, is it after me? I think it is. I'm gonna skedaddle. Music is suggesting that I am being chased. Anyways, if you wanted to know, you could zoom in and then you can play in first person. But I'm kind of liking this view. It gives me an advantage look and peek around corners. So I'm going to stay in this view. I think it's also helpful to you guys. I'm going to go ahead and craft a bandage. Can I? No, I cannot. Okay, let me go up to the workbench while we're waiting for the day to come. Knock knock, I'm home. Okay, there we go. That should give me an additional 30 health. Now let's see. Oh! That's still a really long cycle and I don't have a bit. Um, I need to craft the hammer again. Damn. Damn. Alright, to the body it is. Straight ahead. Um, I don't think I can fall from this height. Let's make a round. Wait, it's getting bright. Oh, okay, so it's going right to left. I see. I thought we were just entering the night. So it's going to be morning in a few seconds, and that is nocturnal, right? Yeah, it's nocturnal. So it should be. Wait, look at the speed. It's on the lowest. Why did it caught up to me so fast just now? That's a lie. Oh, so that's a cave. Are you going to sleep then? Okay, it is. Okay. What's your stat like? Your speed is so fast! Okay, 
Are you coming after me? Oh my god. Get juked. Okay. Come on. Save some stamina. Don't mind me. Oh more. Oh I can't jump. Okay. Body? Body, where are you, body? Take all. Did I take it? I don't think I did. I gotta double check. Sorry. I did, I did, I did, I did. Okay, I assume I did. Okay, I'm gonna juke them. Right here, I'm gonna jump off. Oh my god, there's more ants there. Okay. Okay. Hungry and thirsty. Okay, I think I have bigger problems. <gasps> oh my god. I'm so silly. Alright. This time getting back safe. Um how do I delete or remove? Okay, remove marker by right clicking. Let's only set my gravestone as priority right now. Priority alpha. Before night comes, I need to get my stuff back. It's so easy to get lost. I wish there was like a mini map. That way I can look at the terrain. Is that it? That is it. Mr. Grasshopper, please have mercy. No, why you see me so fast? Oh my god, I juked it. He didn't even see me. Uh, no ants. Good. See, I fell from this height and I died. Hi. Oh, you're peaceful. Are you? I I don't know. Maybe he just didn't see me. I don't know. He kind of felt like he was chasing me before. Oh, that's a lot of wood. Okay, don't get distracted. Build the bed first. <sighs> this game can get pretty intense and I've barely met <laughs> the enemies I barely scratched the surface of the game I'm enjoying myself if you guys enjoy what you see definitely check out the link in the description below right so um, bit 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 let's craft a bit bop 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 Okay, so I need to just craft it from my inventory, I guess. Crafting... Okay. Oh, my bad. From the hammer. Yep. Simple bit, there we go. Let's craft you... Right there. Good. Activate spawn point. There we go. I am Groot Simple Bird. Yes, that is my name on Steam. Even though I'm Bob in this game. Alright, uh, let's see. What else can I make right now? Made with strange artifacts to shape complex and hardy materials. Chest, workbench, and that. Campfire. Let's build this one outside. I guess maybe because of the angle. Yep. 
use ant skewer highly seasoned and perfectly roasted wait so does that mean the ant I got was to eat hard and sturdy great for protection yet deliciously crunchy when cooked ah so it's for eating then I'm just gonna make the mushroom for now Okay, um, let's make a storage. Is it facing the right way? How do I tell? Okay, I assume this would be the front. Let's get you to the corner. There we go. Um, use. Huh, that's pretty small for storage space. Okay, so it looks like this stacks up to 50, so I'm going to keep 5. This is almost a full stack. Can be processed into metal or used in stone working machinery. I'm just going to keep this as a crafting material. Ooh, what else? Maybe I keep the set of clothes that I'm not going to use. And then let's keep half of this. How do I split stack? Left shift, click. Okay, confirm. Let's keep three in there, so I don't lose everything. Uh, let's keep it and hit. Okay, I think I'm gonna. I have another stack here of resin. I got. Okay. All right, I think I'm gonna keep everything else. Let's just close. Ah. Uh... Oh yeah, bow and arrow. Weapon time. Let's go hunting. Wood. Did I store wood? I did. Sorry about that. I really did for a while. Kind of all over the place, aren't I? All right, simple bow. Crafted. Awesome. All right. Um, let's put you in my third slot. Now arrows. Do I have enough? Yes, I do. Ten. Let's make thirty. And then let's also get a wooden sword for emergencies. I'm gonna put you on my. S let's actually just put you in the first slot, and then the axe on the second slot. Okay. Maybe I should switch this around, and then put the axe on the third slot. Okay. Um, I think that's all I can do at the moment. I need this as well, bull and mandible, and then resin. I have that, but I don't have the bull and mandible, do I? I do not. And I need a crude hatchet. Where do I get chitin from? Hungry and thirsty. I'm at 30, 50. How am I hungry already? Where is my mushroom? There we go. Eat. And then let's have a drink. I am at 65, let's have one more mushroom, 95, good, I need to heal, alright, so I have two more healing here, um, alright, I think that's enough, okay, now, adventure time, let's go towards Drustana, since she's within the map, I assume, this is where the game wants me to go first, Uh, wrong way, okay. Alright, we're finally trying to progress the story. Keep up, guys. I am going the right way. Okay. I'm probably going to be avoiding caves like that. You need to equip an arrow to use a bow. Wait, what do you mean? It's in my inventory! You need to equip an arrow to use the bow. What does that mean? Oh! Okay, okay, okay. Ah, uh, I see. What is this? 
I see, okay, now can I do it then? I can. So holding uses stamina, can I cancel? I just hold to cancel? I don't know. I guess it's like a timeout. Now the question is, is there a drop? Let's find out. Are you easy to kill? Oh, I can't see. Too far. Can I jump and shoot? I cannot jump and shoot. Can I pick up my arrows? I cannot. Can I craft arrows? I cannot. Okay, so I have only 28 then. Let's try and save as much as we can. Um, I am heading this direction. I'm going to try and avoid them. Because it sounds like there's a lot. Um, let's go this direction. Seriously? Are you guys still chasing me? Okay, that's a lot of stamina usage. I can cut straight and left. Can I? Man, the map is so hard to read. If I come up to a dead end, I am so sorry. Why does it feel like I'm not supposed to be seeing Justana and that's like the first character I ever met? I'm sorry if I'm wrong. Editor, hide this mistake. Don't show them my mistake. I kind of feel like I am going the wrong way. If I am, just remove this part of the video. Because it's kind of embarrassing, no? But I don't think I came this way. No way. Why? This is like the only way I'm supposed to go, right? Hmm. I wonder why. that was my mistake um, so I'm gonna remove this mark and then I assume Scotty will be the next person we're seeing I could be wrong seek out settlers and investigate their claims is an S, like settlers. So I assumed that Drustana or Skadi was one of them, but I guess not. So let's just head over to Skadi. Sorry guys. Honest mistake. An adventure awaits. Salute. Let's 
gonna rain. I love the sound of thunder, it sounds so good. Give me a right butterfly, please. Okay, it seems like we're going back to Mr. Grasshopper. And then I probably have to cross the bridge just one more time. Not bridge, but the river. Friendly. I assume I could probably go in there, but I don't want to. Not yet, at least. Now, how am I gonna cross? Do I have to go up there? I think that's probably... What are you? Bull ant. Ooh, I need your... Seven? Really? Eleven. Okay, so the more I charge, the more damage I do. That's good to know. That was a lot of damage on the... I don't need any more, I got two. I'm out. Mercy. Please. Let me go. Ha! Can you climb? Oh my god, it did damage. safe it's safe okay let's see I got two right yeah I can make my pickaxe now Ooh, look at the world this looks amazing what's the sound it's a bottle oh was it like a bee <gasps> oh there you are that attack made me step forward. I like my heart just gave way for a second there. Let's try and reach our destination before night, but just looking kind of tight. I'm probably just gonna sit and wait, and I'm gonna cut the video so that you guys don't have to sit here and wait. Oh my god, game, why? Why you do this to me, game? Okay. Note to self. Leaves are not tangible. Oh my god. Why? I'm gonna make my way Probably gonna be a night soon. Okay, if I'm not mistaken, let's look. Yeah, night is coming in a few. Uh, that was so unexpected. Like I did not see that happening at all. I thought I was like close. I was so proud of myself. It's a huge ladybug. I knew something was behind me. Okay. I'm almost there. Oh, I just read the instructions. E is block. Who uses E for block? Oh, I'm so happy it's up here. Oh, thank you.
strawberries. These are probably the strongest thing I've seen so far. No way, no, no, no. Peaceful, peaceful. Why are there so many bees? Ow, ow. What are you? Can I... Poppy? Do I need a hatchet as well? Yep, I need a hatchet. Ow, 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 ow. I'm almost there. Blocking takes stamina too. Okay. Is that a bull end? It is. Okay, at least I know I can outrun this. Uh, every time he attacks, that's like this delay. So it's not too bad. Okay, I spoke too soon. Why are there so many bees? What is that? What does this look more demonic than it's supposed to be? Okay. Um Let's talk to this owl first. Some creatures can be tamed using special treats. Be careful though, they will only accept treats once they recognize you as their leader. So make sure to beat them into submission first. Once tamed, creatures will be faithful companion. Some will follow you and protect you. Some will even allow you to mount them. You can heal a tamed creature with food. Drop food close to your companion. Ooh. Am I about to get a pet? What's in here? Skadi Uxilm. I'm a hunter by trade and a former vanguard sergeant. I've been sent to investigate reports of trouble with some of the creatures in the area. Ludwig mentioned he would be sending someone. What do you need? Let's check out the armor first, shall we? Hmm. Blunt resistance. Insect fur bones. Herpetile hide. Protection, great coal resistance. Okay, what's chitin armor? Hmm, protection is a bit higher, but it's not that great for cold. Durability and protection, it's cumbersome and hard to move in. So I guess my movement speed will be slower. Hmm, I see that movement speed minus 3%. Okay. Anything I can take from you? No. Um, have you had any troubles here? You could say that I was hunting near the overturned boat when I was attacked by an enraged rhino beetle. It's a dangerous threat that needs to be dealt with before it kills someone. Map updated. I'll take care of it. No. I would advise you to be cautious and well prepared before facing it. Should you be able to defeat it, bring me torn for examination. This will allow me to understand its origins. Ah, uh, I can barely kill ants, lady. Uh, okay, so basically armor, that's it. Okay. It's a cool key. I'm going to take a quick break and I'll be back.
Okay, so I'm back. I'm gonna try and fight this rhino beetle. Do or die. If I die, I die. What happens if I? Maybe I'll try after the beetle. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, I'm gonna hunt the beetle. What time is it? It's in the middle of the night. Maybe I'm gonna chill here for a little bit. Can I sleep? Can I let time pass? No, I cannot. Okie dokie. Pretty excited. Like, what is this creature, anyways? And how did you even manage to carry the bones? And what keys did this lead to? Can I sleep here? No. Alright. Time to make a move. I have 23 arrows. Mm, let's assume I do 10 damage each. That's 230. Uh, let's heal a bit. I have no more healing. I didn't think about bringing anything. I'm going to nourish myself a little bit. I think I get a buff from feeling full. Not too sure. Oh, attributes. There we go. Um, endurance, dexterity, stat increase speed by 0 0.5, damage. Let's just go full damage. No, I cannot. Um, health or speed? I'm gonna go speed and damage since I'm gonna fight. Well nourished, what does this mean? So like a health boost or am I healing? Alright, I think that's about all I can do and prepare. Let's go. Rhino Beetle, that's where I'm going. It's almost day. I think I'll probably reach there. Wait a little bit till it is day. And then we will slaughter this Rhino. Or be slaughtered. too dark for me to scan. Level 7 moth. Look at that speed. I can't wait to be able to tame. Okay. Um, I think the sun is rising soon. Yep. It's probably down by the boat. You can see the boat right there on my screen. I hope you can see it. It's a bit dark. That's why I'm going to wait out a little bit before I have this final boss fight. I'm calling it a boss fight, it's probably just like everyday life in small land. It's a pretty big drop. I'm just gonna wait a little bit. Enjoy this night light. Anyways, I'm loving how the game is so far. I'm pretty preoccupied with trying to survive. I can already see that the story is going to be pretty awesome. I'm enjoying it so far, like the progression. Um, I haven't been able to look around too much on the weapon upgrades and the armor just yet, as I just started. But yeah, I'm I think almost two hours in. Uh, just trying to <laughs> figure stuff out, make my base. All right, where is this beetle, and which way shall I go? I'm gonna follow the trunk right here. Probably the safest route. I can't scan. I wanna see what level the bee is. Where can I see? Hmm. I'll probably cut through the left. To avoid the bees. Is that you? No, that can't be, right? It's not a rhino beetle. Looks more like a cockroach. Ooh, look at the sun rays. Awesome. Ok, 
Okay, um, safest way down. Where is the safest way? What are you? Water bug. Uh, oh no, 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 okay, guys, I'm sorry. <gasps> no, 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 What are you? No, 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 no. Eat the, eat the bug, eat the bug. Yes, eat the bug. Oh my god. Please have mercy on me. Jump. Please. Oh my god. Alright guys, if you want to find out how I fight this rhino, stay tuned. Or try out the game yourself, because clearly I am <laughs> nowhere near being ready. Ah, oh my god. Okay, so that was uh, not the end I was expecting. At least it wasn't the gecko that got me. Anyways, I enjoyed the game. I definitely love the graphics and where this is going and the fact that they're constantly releasing more laws, NPCs and stories along with armor and other weapons. It's definitely going in the right direction, I would say. Check it out yourself, definitely check out the game on Steam or Epic Store. Play with friends, go for the maximum, get 9 new friends. Just before we go, I am going to shoot this butterfly. As I say, I am going to shoot this butterfly. There is drop. Okay, I'm going to go into first person. I'm going to shoot this butterfly. I will one day hit this butterfly. Oh my god, one shot. Did you see that? Oh my god, I am so good. I am a sniper. Ah, so that's where the eggs came from. Anyways, be sure to try this out yourself. Tell me how far your best shot was. I'm definitely going to hit this one. And then we're going to end the video. Soon. 15 arrows left. Soon. One day. Two day. Alright. That definitely hit. Yep. Definitely hit. Alright. Thanks guys for watching. Save the game. See you.